Welcome back. I'm Tammy Arinder, and you're watching L.A. Rider, Louisiana's premier motorcycle television show. Well, if you missed last week, you missed us romping and reminiscing through my hometown of Tallulah, and you also missed a history lesson about the birth of Delta Airlines and the fact that Harold Jenkins, known as Conway Twitty, country music legend, all had ties to the northeast Louisiana town. Well, now I want you to travel with us as we go to Oak Grove and Lake Providence. This part of Northeast Louisiana is known as the Delta Region. This is a field of dreams for farmers. The Mississippi River provides Madison and East Carroll parishes with rich farmland, so acres and acres of cotton, corn, and soybeans flourish in this area. As you travel from Tallulah to Lake Providence, you not only see rows and rows of crops, but you can also see a bat along the way in Transylvania. This is also home to one of the most gorgeous lakes and popular fishing holes around, Lake Providence. It's a natural oxbow lake that's outlined by Highway 65, which makes for a beautiful motorcycle ride. If you make a turn off Highway 65 onto Highway 2, you'll soon cross over into West Carroll Parish. That's another great destination. Just 10 miles from Lake Providence, you'll hit the square in Oak Grove. It's one of the few tiny towns in Louisiana which has a thriving business district surrounding its courthouse. Even KWCL Radio is celebrating 50 years on the air. And just like back in the good old days, a single screen movie house has been revived. The Fist Theater is probably the oldest theater still in operation in northeast Louisiana. The name Fisk Theater dates back to 1928 when Mr. Uh, Donald Fisk bought the theater from a gentleman from uh, Monticello, Arkansas. And Not only is it a movie theater, but it's also a concert venue where tonight an Elvis tribute artist will perform. Is that a relative of yours? Yes, it is. Shay Arinder happens to be my brother, but he is one of the most phenomenal Elvis tribute artists I have ever seen. It, it, I'm amazed. He got all the singing talent. Well, actually, my sister can sing, too. I can't. I can just talk. While the mere existence of the Fisk and its one ticket booth, walls of memorabilia and its original movie projectors bring back memories of the good old days, Shea Arinder brings back memories of the King. Well, I started when I was 12 years old on, in New Orleans on Commodore Cruise Line, and from that point, I just fell in love with it. After watching and listening to hours of Elvis records and TV shows, he learned that Elvis wasn't just a great singer, but he connected with his audience. So Shay tries to bring that same Presley persona to his performance. He sure makes it look easy. While Shay and his band light up the stage, the Fist Theater marquee lights up the Oak Grove night, reminding us that the good old days are right here, right now.